What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Ia Solo Thoughts. And today, we are going to be reacting to this video called Modern Woman is Too Fat to Find Love. That sounds kind of harsh, but hey, we're going to see what they're talking about. Make sure y'all comment, like, and subscribe. This gentleman and I matched on Tinder. We started chatting the other day. Um, then he disappeared. Then he reappeared. See, that's already a red flag right there. He disappeared and then he reappeared. Some people don't look at those early signs at the beginning stages, but you have to be mindful of everything that goes on between the two of you, between the opposite person, because, hey, that's a red flag. <laughs> you got to be ready for that. You know, open your eyes, open your mind up, and yeah. That's what you got to do. And uh, actually showed initiative and in wanting to go on a date. Um, set a day, a time, a place. And I said, okay, perfect. And I said, well, it takes me half an hour to get there. You know, give me about 45 minutes and, and I'll meet you there. And uh, still on Tinder, not actually texting. So now it is now 1235. We were set to meet at 1230. Not only is the restaurant that he decided to bring us to um, not open today, uh, he also unmatched me on Tinder. See, that's cowardly. That's, that's, that's cowardly. A man, I can't respect that as a man. You, <laughs> you got to own up to yourself. Why are you leading people on? Why are you leading this woman on? You told this woman you was going to meet her at this restaurant at this specific time and y'all was going to go on a date but it's so many it's so many things that you did wrong one you had the woman get ready and waste her gas driving to you two the restaurant wasn't open that you told her to meet you up at three you unmatched her on tinder without telling her why like, come on now, bro, don't leave people on. Why? I, I'd never understand the mind of ghosters because me personally, I do not ghost people. I use my voice, communication. All you had to say was, you know what? I think we shouldn't go on a date anymore. I'm not interested in you no more. That's all you had to say. Or if that wasn't the case, maybe you was busy. Uh, you know what? Maybe we should reschedule the, the date. Something came up and I won't be able to go to the date. So I was wondering, would you be fine if we rescheduled it? That's it. Why are you leading people on? It'd be the same people that say they looking for somebody and they doing stuff like this. <laughs> I don't know anymore, man. Dating sucks. That's all I got to say. Dating sucks. But that doesn't mean it's the end. <laughs> it's not the end. But it's it's not looking too good right now. Um, so now I have no communication because he has all of my information when he unmatched me. Um. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. If this woman ever comes across my reaction, I just want to say this to you. Don't give up. Don't let that man be the reason why you never date again. Um, Keep your head high and just know that there's somebody for somebody. There's somebody for you. There's somebody for me. There's somebody for him, her. There's somebody for everybody, you know, so. Um, stay positive, you know, keep living your life like you do and the right man will come your way. So that's all I want to give to you, this advice. And hey, hopefully the next guy, he actually shows up to the date and doesn't bail on you. I mean, you seem like a cool person. So, hey, it's going to work out for you. You know, when you do good, good things come your way. So don't quit. Stay positive.